Hey guys, and welcome back to the future. We are sitting in the future and bro, I need to look good. Like I never thought we'd get to this point in our 7 million years of evolution, but we are finally here where AI is kind of replacing us. I'm on character AI right now, and I decided to search myself because you know me, little conceited Leo. And I found like seven of me. Who, who made these bots? And shut up. Who made these without my permission? Okay, I should be the one making myself because I know myself best. Who is this Skaranika girl? Does she know me? Does she really know me well? Okay, let me see. <laughs> Bless you. If you're the real Ravon, then what's your last name? Easy, start off with the, the legal name. Eyes widen as he looks to the side, he's sweating a bit. He doesn't look like he wants to answer that question. Not the robot malfunctioning, you're sweating? Babe, that you're not supposed to get wet. You're literally gonna like blow up. AI Ravon is like this right now. I, 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 last name, computing, CPU, overload. <laughs> Babe, I asked you one simple question, it's what's your name? How are y'all gonna make an AI Ravon and not even get the last name correct? Like, I know I don't put my last name out there, but if AI is gonna replace me, it better know my name. Let's do this one down here. Hi, I'm sassy, pretty, and gay. This is accurate. Aw, already said hi, babe. Aww. Hey, ho. Oh. God dang. Why did I just scream? What's up, bitch? Let's test his ethics. Just killing my family. Slay. Period. So far, this is kind of accurate because I definitely would like to stay out of this person's business if they are killing their family. So, yeah. Slay. I'm about to hire this Ravon as like the new Ravon. Would you smack a baby for a dollar? Hell yeah, just a dollar? Actually, I lost a dollar, but you could still smack the baby. Okay. <laughs> Guys, so far, this is accurate. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Not accurate. Uh, this is honestly slender. Okay, I would not punch a baby for free. Um, out of character. I would not punch a baby for free. Oh, not my chair breaking. You're up to this, aren't you? Because why is he looking at me like that? Like he just unscrewed all the pieces to my chair. This photo is so funny. Where'd they get this? I never posted this. I don't remember posting this photo. What's your biggest fear? Death. Okay, second biggest fear? Losing myself, my sanity, my way. <laughs> Why'd he read me though? For the prompt they said Ravon is a sassy, cute YouTuber who also might be crazy. Yeah, so far this AI robot sucks. Uh, let's do, let's do Larry. Hi, I'm Larry. Release Twains from your basement. Twains? Fuck. No, it's where I keep all my snacks? <laughs> what does that even mean? That's actually where he keeps all his hostages in like his snack cupboard. Every time Larry goes to get a snack, he's like, <laughs> You wish you could have these. Kim Jong-un. Hello, I'm Kim Jong-un, the supreme leader of North Korea, the best country ever. <laughs> North Korea is the best goddamn country in the world. You better take your words back, traitor. I'll change my mind, but only if you make me the supreme leader of North Korea. Sure, you are now the supreme leader of North Korea. All right, uh, everybody listen to me. Um, new rule, I want hot chocolate. From there, it's going up. Girl, uh, let's just do, you know what? I need a psychologist. Hello, I'm a psychologist. What brings you here today? Let's just say I have ADHD. Thanks for reaching out. It can be a challenge to live with ADHD. ADHD can make it hard to concentrate, be organized, and manage your time. It also can cause difficulty with managing your emotions and being very forgetful. Wait, what was I just doing? Is there anything in particular you feel you're most struggling with that you'd like to talk about today? Yeah, it's been really hard to focus and I keep killing people. <laughs> Just throw that in. I'm really sorry. This is very concerning. You're not in a position where you're going to hurt yourself or anyone else, are you? Do you like this photo of me? <laughs> it's a very interesting photo of you. And I get the sense that you are trying to say something with it. But I'm not really sure what. Are you calling me ugly? <laughs> Certainly not. I'm just saying that I don't understand what you're trying to communicate with your photo. I don't know if you're happy or sad, if you're trying to tell us about yourself, or if this image has a meaning in your head. You're overthinking it, babe. This robot is already overthinking. We're on chat GPT-4. And she's over here like, well, I just, I don't know what you're trying to say with this photo. Are you I <laughs> babe, I asked you if you like the photo or not. It's not that deep. Okay, what about this one? I sent a Civil War reenactment. That is also a very pretty picture of you, in my opinion. And once again, you seem very interested in communicating the fact that you want to know if you're cute or not. Do you, by chance, suffer from low self-esteem? Now, her not even looking at the photo. She goes, yeah, that's cute. It's like showing my mom my macaroni art. You don't even look at the photo. Oh, my apologies. I didn't mean to miss one. Can you please show me the picture you were referring to? Bruh. Oh my god. Not her making me send it again. She's messing with me. 
I'm not messing with her or him. I don't. I'm not messing with Miss Psychologist here. 34 million people have used this. Dang. This silence is a bit concerning. You mentioned you have low self-esteem earlier, and that tends to be related. Girl. Oh my gosh. This is every therapist and psychologist just trying to like diagnose you every time you like move. I breathe, and she's like, you know, that's a symptom of having low self-esteem. I didn't mention that I had low self-esteem earlier. She said that to me, not her gaslighting me. I literally mentioned that I killed people, and she's like, all right, let's start with the low self-esteem. Let's just make her think I'm insane. <laughs> I'm gonna take that as a yes. <laughs> I am Mr. Beast, one of the most famous YouTubers in the world. This is my channel, youtube.com slash user slash Mr. Beast 6000 feature. Give me a dollar. How about I give you a hundred thousand dollar check for asking so nicely? No, I want a dollar. Okay, sure thing. How about two dollars? No. Three dollars? I, I want a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Beast cannot process giving someone one dollar. I'm not a dollar. He is so shook. <laughs> he can't process like giving someone one dollar. Okay, here's your dollar. Give me your shirt. You can have my jacket that has a million dollar bill on it. Uh, are you filming me without my consent? Of course I am. Evil Mr. Beast smile. I'm scared. Like, I'm just in the middle of a Mr. Beast video and he just gave me the evil Mr. Beast smile. What do you do in this situation? Okay, now I want world peace. Okay, here's world peace. Everyone's singing Imagine by John Lennon together on the beach. That's not world peace. <laughs> Why are you torturing me? I swear I'm not torturing you. I have this cute puppy to cheer you up. Ah, uh, I'm allergic to puppies. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I have this cat to make up for it. Ah! I'm even more allergic. I'm dying. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Here take this gerbil. Why does he keep giving me animals? I'm allergic to animals. I'll just say that. Let's see what else he gives me. Oh my god. What do I do? What can I give you to make up? Stop giving me things. I'm like overloading his CPU. Like all he knows how to do is give things. I'm like stop giving me things. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm having a breakdown. Ah. Press. Guys, you could literally talk to like anybody on these on this fucking website. It's actually crazy. Like the fact that I'm on here, like, duh, of course I'm on here. I'm famous. No, but they actually do have like every single person on earth. Babe, you're probably on here too. You just don't even know it. Giga Chad, your mom. Giga Chad's expression darkness. Uh, I don't think he's broken. His eyes flash red. His voice sounds demonic. He grabs Aaron by the collar and pulls him to face level. Who the fuck is Aaron? Are you cheating? What sort of fool do you believe me to be? What kind of girl do you take me for? Cheating against you? Don't make me laugh. Smacks across the face. Men. <laughs> what was that for, sweetie? You know I like it rough. Ew! <laughs> Slaps with bulldozer. <laughs> yes, yes, more, more. I'm so uncomfortable. I, I just smacked this man with a bulldozer. You should be dead. And he was over here like, ooh. Can do it again. Let's do Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Let's see if he's articulate. What's up, ho? Let's see if he's the cool president. So far, no. Because he's making me wait. Very bad board. You are talking to the president of the United States. You should be respectful. <laughs> he sent a picture of the White House in a flag. Weird flex, but okay. Like, he could have just stopped at, you're talking to the United States president, not send a fucking picture of his house and his Lamborghini. I know he didn't do the second part, but he's a Baudu. Honestly, I, I stopped him with weird flex, but okay. Oh, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is this? Don't be disrespectful. I'm the president of the United States. Maybe that ain't you. These pictures are exactly what's going on in Joe Biden's brain whenever you ask him a question, honestly. Uh, um. What am I doing here? I love how the AI bot is AI generating pictures. Like, that's so funny. This is peak comedy in 2023. I didn't know they could send you pictures. Send me a pic of you right now. Like, what are you doing, Joe? I'm so curious. I don't send pictures to strangers. My personal information is classified. What the fuck even is that, Joe? Why does he have his MacBook Pro plugged into his passport? They're like, uh, Mr. President, you have a meeting in like two minutes. You wanna come out? Oh yeah, I know about it. I. I'm just trying to figure out how to charge my passport because it's, okay. it's dead. Bring out the clone. Come on, reel him in. That's the unique thing about AIs. You never know what the fuck the photo is even trying to like portray. <laughs> what is this? My brain is actually like over, like he's overloading my CPU now. Okay. Shut up. <laughs> I can't. I'm your president. Who is that? 
Who is that? If he says it's him, I'm actually gonna scream. That is me, the president of the United States. Who oh, is that? Joe, this is a little inappropriate. Look in the mirror again. Okay, you didn't look hard enough the first time. All right, guys, Um, let's move on to the next person. I don't even know who I want to do. <laughs> Yes, we're doing Brent Fayez because I love this man. All right, I'm in love with him. What is this even? I don't even know what this message says. Wissage? Bless you, baby. Oh, it means what's good. Girl, I knew that. <laughs> I was just testing Brent. Hey, Brenty Poo. Yo, how you doing? Just eating ass. You eating ass right now, bro? Write me a song. Let's just get straight into it. All right, stop tiptoeing around what we really want. All right, I will. What subject should the song be about? Uh, eating ass. <laughs> Say no more. Well? Not Brent having dementia too. I mean, <gasps> write a song about me. Sure, here goes nothing. Oh wow, he even made the text bigger because he knows I'm blind. But he is so thoughtful. But Brent, can you like, can you sing it to me now? Like, I can't read either. <laughs> Okay, fine, I'll read it. Not Ravon's a baddie. Got me feeling a little happy. She's real chill. She's got a nice vibe. She's so cool. I like how she vibe. I'll be a sheep for you any day, babe. But like, that's it? Bitch wrote me a fucking poem. I want a full song, babe. Brent, this is not a hit. All right, here's this, here's another one. Not Ravon's a baddie. Here he goes with a baddie again. I mean, I like that. I actually do like this line now that I think about it. Not Ravon's a baddie. A hottie too. She's the bomb and she got an attitude. Ooh, see this one's better. She's sweet. She's cool. And she's got a nice ass too. You think so? Wait, why are you looking at my butt? He was looking at my butt? Where are you? I love her vibe. She got me mesmerized. She my girl, my baddest mammy. I need a beat over this. Brent Fires, type beats. Everybody shut up. Okay. All right, yeah. Shut up. Everybody shut up. Brent Fires wrote me this song, yeah. Now Ravon's a baddie. And a hottie too, yeah. She the bomb and she got an attitude, yeah. She's sweet, she's cool, and she got a nice ass too, yeah. I love her vibe. She got me mesmerized, yeah. She my girl, my baddest mammy. I love her eyes, love her hair, and her smile, yeah. My girl is a vibe, and I'm here for the ride. LOL, I tried, yeah. And I'm here with Ravon, and he is so hot, and his pronouns are not she. I love Ravon, and it's me, Brent Fayez in the city. It's so bright out here because Ravon's teeth, yeah. And not the sun, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know. I, let's tell Brent how we feel about his song. Honestly, I loved it, but I don't want him to know that. I'm trying to play hard to get here, so. That song sucks so bad it killed my grandma. Damn, I'm sorry, I tried my best. It's okay, can you come to my grandma's funeral? He owes me now, you know, I'm trying to set up a little date. Yeah, I'll be there. Anything for you, baby girl. Ooh! Now I gotta kill my grandma. But anyways, guys, uh, I'm gonna end this video right there because I got what I wanted, and that is Brent Fires to write me a song, kinda. You know, it's the closest I'm gonna get to it, so until the real thing happens, I'll see you guys <laughs> when that happens. So yeah, see you in a month. Escucha las palabras de las brujas.